Dave here, I'm with Pastor George Davis. Pastor, what's the mistake that most churches make today? In my assessments, I want to be very careful about this, Dave. I mean, that's uh, asking a pastor that question. But I, I, I honestly, I think one of the, the greatest mistakes that the body of Christ, the church makes today, is the lack of authentic, authenticity, being real. The fact of the matter is, is that we, for some reason, we've, we've, we've picked up this notion that in the body of Christ, in the church, in the local church, that everything has to appear like we've all got it together. And the reality of it is that from the pulpit to the pew, no one has it all together. So therefore, the power of our witness, the power of our ability to empathize, the power of our ability to attract others who may be hurting, who are in need, we lose that. We, we look at Jesus himself. I mean, you go through all the Gospels, you don't find him any way or any form or fashion saying, I have it all together. He was able to, to get down, if you would, or to reach anybody at any level because he was able to empathize. Well, it's very difficult to do that if you, if you want to uh, have the appearance that you have it all together, that, that this is the perfect church, that we're, li we're all living this out, when the reality of it is nobody. It's living it all out. So I, th I think one of the biggest mistakes is that we are not being authentic and real and saying that we are all on a journey, applying this word of God to our lives, walking together, but recognizing that I'm no better than the next person. So I think that as far as the power of witness that the church could have, we lose that because people are not being real. The, the preaching is not real. Uh, the singing's not real. Uh, we're not dealing with the deeper issues in our lives to understand that maybe we should deal with the deeper issues in our life before we offer our gifts to God. So being authentic.